Have you heard of the art of manifesting from Mind Valley, created by Regan Hillier? If no, today I'll introduce you to the topic. I'm Latia J, and I'm a manifesting coach. If you enjoy my channel, please subscribe and comment below if anything piques your curiosity. So, I took the manifesting course a few months ago in order to find my purpose in life. I wanted to use it to experience and discover more about manifesting, to become a better manifester, and just to have more guidance to give to my clients as I work with them. So the main three points that I have today are around three of the things that I learned or participated in from this workshop and or this program. It's, um, I believe it's a 21 or 28 day program. There's daily activities to accomplish, and they have these things called activations, which get your energy aligned and shift the way you see yourself and how you operate. So the first thing that I really enjoyed about this program is the idea of incremental progress. So incremental progress is the idea that by shifting your behavior by 1% to 2%, you're going to slowly but surely get to a 100% change. So instead of trying to make a 180, you make these short changes to slowly make your turnaround in life. And that makes it easier to make changes and to progress because as we grow and develop, we don't want that shock to our system. If we try to change too many things at once or we try to make too big of a change at once, it shocks us and we go back to a, our original set point. Now, our set point is this idea of homeostasis and what is familiar to us. So that is our regular like level of activity, regular level of eating or nourishment and our energy levels. It's just what's within us that tends to be the norm. Now, when we're wanting to make changes in our life, we're wanting to raise our set point usually. And so we want to be able to expand our capacity to receive, expand our capacity to take care of ourselves, or do anything that helps us to grow and develop into better people. Now, making a small shift is going to be the best route to creating lasting change instead of trying to like whip yourself in the into shape and like change everything at one time so it's the idea that if you're training for a marathon you'd rather start with getting off the couch and running like walking down the street to start versus trying to run two miles a day right out the gate so steve bartlett talks about this concept in the diary of a CEO as well. So it's one that's very useful in terms of making changes in your life. And I really enjoy it because it works for me. And another thing about this program is the activations. They are a mixture of meditations and energy activations that shift the way you see yourself and how you operate. So there's also soul work that you complete, which are usually a series of questions that allow you to dive deeper into the topic and realize things about yourself and the work that you're doing and what you do are wanting out of your manifestation. Um, I kept a manifesting journal and I really enjoyed using it to do the exercises and I highly recommend having a manifestation journal just for tracking your manifestations, keeping up with what you're creating and having a space for these practices. Now, one of the ideas that she talks about that I really love was the how addiction. It's, we always have our hows. How do I make this happen? And, you know, how will this happen? How will it come about? We have a million how questions that we ask. And it's an opportunity to connect with the fact that how can stop us. If we need to know how to do something, Sometimes that is that becomes a block on our road to progress. So instead of making progress, we get stuck in how will I accomplish this instead of focusing on our vision and what we're striving to create in our lives and who we're becoming in the process. So 
she has an exercise called the how dump that I enjoyed, which is pretty much just to write out all the hows that you have on your mind. And I think you might write how it could happen out. It's been a little bit since I've taken it, but it's a really great exercise. I highly recommend this course. It was such a great experience and I gained so much clarity on my purpose, which was my focus. So if you're looking to manifest more in your life, I highly recommend taking this course. And if you're wanting support on the journey, then reach out to me and maybe we could have a coaching session to see if manifesting coaching would be a fit for you on your journey of manifesting. So comment below if you are interested in having a gifted coaching session. I'm working on 100 coaching sessions in 100 days and would love to connect with you. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.